Hello everybody and welcome to another- What was that? You know I stream on Twitch every single day? Well, what the hell am I here for? Go enjoy the video! I barely made it into this prelim. I wanted to play Grazer Yogg, but I had one minute left to register my deck. Is it prowess it is? Is it prowess it is? Is it prowess or is it not the prowess? Soul Scar Mage, your turn, Yugi boy. Big D. Show me your moves, Big D. I'm surprised I even made it on time. I thought for sure I was gonna miss this prelim. What's up, daughter? I thought I was gonna miss it for sure. I uh big dad. What's up, Ghost Dad? I didn't really want to play Prowess, I wanted to play Golgari Yogmoth, but here we are. Playing Prowess instead. Stabbing some peeps with some spell spear. They're playing a red deck. Maybe they're playing the Nissa scam. Dilly! Shimata Dilly! Thank you for the 10 gifties. I appreciate ya. Alright, I'll let this happen. Bang bang! Yeah, I'll get some bang bangs in here. Bang bangs for my boy. Shoot Dilly. poppy has got the cards. Let's see if I can open this. Ah, can't open this. There we go. I bought a couple of Narsets. So, there's two Narsets I bought. I couldn't decide which one I liked better. So there's the foil etched one, which is like, pretty neat. And then there's this one, which is like a Halo rainbow foil. I don't know which one I like better. I'd have to say the rainbow foil. It just looks so nice. A burrito on your left, and another burrito on your right. That's the best way to do it, my dude. Ah, I bought a bunch of sleeves. I'm going to cast EI. Hopefully I hit a land. That would be nice. Did hit a land. I'll take the DRC. Honestly, I think I just attack him and play a DRC. Tough call though. My poor spell spear. Terminated and gone forever. Yeah, I'm with you, Dilly. Yellow foil, all day. So nice. I was actually trying to get rid of most of my foil cards in paper. I'm tired of them curling. You want your limited edition gun? Alright, here's your gun. Put him up, Zeriok. That's fine. I could actually clear this out and probably kill them. I gotta do some intense math here, though. Dart. Do a little bit of scrying. Mutagenic growth. Is that lethal? I have to go dart, flashback, dart, growth, growth. That's 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I think it puts them to 3. Is that right? Probably not good enough. Another soul scar mage. Maths for blockers. And oh boy, I'm not blocking. You went to buy a gun today? Like a true American? We're all burn players at the end of the day. No blocks. So, three, four, okay, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Put them to one. Is that right? I'm kind of down to put them to one. I could also mill another lava dart, which I'll try. Oh, no soul scar. Alright, I'll put an EI on top. That seems fine to me. Oh, I should have played the other creature, I think. Definitely should have played the other creature. How you doing, snack deck? Did I say that already? I got hit with the sh intense short term memory loss. <laughs> I can't remember if I said hi to Lesnar or if it was snack deck. Hello to both of you. Yeah, yeah I land bull would have done it too. Alright, what do we want against Scam? Scamaz. You didn't say hi, Bolt Snapple? Yeah, that was intentional. Of course I didn't. Let's take out a couple of mutagenic growths and a couple of metamorphoses. Maybe I want the third mutagenic, and I just cut like all the metamorphoses in this matchup. Metamorphosis is not great. 
Do I want some soul guide lantern? Maybe one soul guide? Two soul guide? Yeah, let's do two soul guide. Alrighty. It be like that sometimes. It really do be like that. You don't think it be like that, but it do be like that. Alright, I gotta rent my Yogg stuff because I never got it. Just ran out of time. I actually would have had enough time to get the Yogg stuff if I had had enough loan balance. But I had to return some stuff. Classic Dingo. Not preparing for the future. That being said, place with Spear and Pass. Not gonna attack him on the block. Give him the opportunity. LGS Modern Monday. At Zeriok Games. Terminate. I don't have this deck uploaded. I had it uploaded a while ago, but I don't have it up right now. That was a risky move, them doing that into potential mutagenic growth, but I did F6, so they know that I don't have mutagenic growth. And they hit my DRC. Game's over. GG got hit by Raghavan. Let me go find this deck so I can pin it. I probably should have taken the land because they are playing a Ren and Six deck. I figured I'd take the Sorcery so they have a harder time turning on a Delirium. Why the hell? Is it prowess? Is it this one? No. That one's really old. I'm just gonna re-upload it, whatever. Yes. Let me grab my Yogg stuff real quick and I'll get it re-uploaded. Alright. Where's is it prowess? Is it prowess? Is it not prowess? Who's to say? Insipid thing for the follow. I appreciate that. Uh, set is current. It's already uploaded. All right, there we go. Put it on E. I mean, that's fine. I'd actually prefer that if they would blow up everything with one CMC. Hope they do that. <laughs> That'd be great for me. I've submitted sixty-one cars, but not on accident. That was very intentional. I'm blocked. Okay. I wonder what the point of this EE on one was. Kind of interesting. I mean, they put a card on top. I wonder what they put on top. We'll play my spell spear, though. I got this key by one from a giveaway. <clears throat> Just like modeled after the SNES or something. Even have like the D Gen desk map behind it too. Maybe a PlayStation One, PlayStation themed. Yeah, I was gonna say PlayStation themed. Next, if it wasn't SNES, no card hoarder pickup. I can't return my cards because I'm in a Pioneer League still. I realized I messed up. I repent for my sins. Please forgive me. Stop trying to trade me. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's not that D Gen anime desk mat check. <laughs> Just chill to have to smoke. Pick up your cards and finish the prelim. I won't. Is it a dingo? It is. I wanted to play Golgari Yogmoth with the Grazers, but I fucked up. Oh, that's really good. Oh, well, I can try to draw for a spell. Maybe I hit a Mutagenic Growth. Mutagenic Growth would be such a blowout for them. I have no cards in hand. Mutagenic. Oh. I'm dead. Yeah, there's a new Yogg variant going around. You should tell them if they pop EE. That's... I hate this fucking card so much. Tell them to pop the EE. It'll turn on Delirium. <laughs> I'll get him. Opponent, pop the EE. It'll turn on Delirium. I hate being on the receiving end of this card. I love playing it, though. Playing it is just free wins. It's got 4x. I'll show you the Yogg list. What'd I call it? Grazer Yogg. So it's got three copies of Arboreal Grazer, four copies of Colony Garden, and two copies of Golgari Rot Farm. 
I'm gonna die if I don't draw something. I'm intensely flooding. Lava dart? Lava. Come on, one time for the one time? Darto? Ice lands? Nice chat message, Vivid. How about that? Oh, I'll, you know, I'll take that. I'm gonna do this in their upkeep. In case they draw an undying effect. Thank you, you're welcome. Okay. Don't... Don't have anything good. Don't dash another Rogavon. Chalice on one. How many cards do you think they brought in that just... Hurt themselves? They have EE on one, Chalice on one, and they had nothing but one drops. I'm actually on three copies of Seismic Assault. I thought it'd be good in the grindy matchup. When I flood. Dunk list. Been playing a lot of prowess lately. I didn't want to. But this is the only deck I had built with cards that I actually own in my collection. Because I couldn't get the rent off in time. It's not the only deck, but it's one of the few. No, you're not supposed to draw a Spyro. Stop it! Discards terminate? Wow. I would not have the gall to discard terminate against the Gigantha. Gigantha's actually pretty good against Skim. Oh, it's all lands. Oops, all lands. What would you play in Nissa deck? I wanted to play Golgari Yogmoth with Arboreal Grazer and Call in the Garden and Golgari Rock Farm. But I failed to rent it in time. I had two seconds left when I joined this. I was like, oh, oh, uh, uh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I gotta stream something. Is it Browse? That's all I had. I give up. You win. Not my streamer. My streamer would never be prepared. Well, I guess if we're gonna have Chalice, I need a couple of Shatterings for you. I don't even think I want these Soul Guide Lanterns. I think I just kind of hate them. Uh, I'll keep the one lander. Hopefully I can get lucky and draw a second. Tan's gonna be so bad if I never draw a second land. I just don't like mulliganing against Skim. Feels real bad. Feels real bad. And red discourse. Which made me not want to play prowess in one sentence. It's kind of impressive. Alright, I'm gonna bolt the Ragavan and upkeep, try to surveil non land. Don't worry, we're gonna play Yogg and shit on Yogg later. You know what? I'll top that. I would love that second land, actually. Can't cast anything with it right now, but this land's got potential. The EI into a third land. I think it was the, this was the only game I had to answer to Ragavan on one. EE -E on one. Okay. I will make sure to play my two drop threat. It's the part where they fury me. For my hubris. My hubris and my greed will be my undoing. With that being said, pass the turn. Please don't scam a fury. <laughs> don't scam a fury, my dude. No, what do you think about that? Okay, well, I was going to save this with a mutagenic growth, but now that they showed me they have the feign death before they let the damage resolve, I'm absolutely not going to mutagenic. They're dead, chief. Yeah, they wanted the F6 value. I'm in a really bad spot. Hey, Bonefish Grill, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. I am so far behind. Maybe this Breach can do something. Unholy Heat? That'd be good. I have one copy in the deck, but if I drew it... I drew three one-drops. We're dead. After, like... 
triple bolt this thing, which means I have to draw a land. Maybe they'll tap out. Maybe they just won't hold up engineered explosives. Is that Mercurio? Uh, so far, not great. Mm okay. Well, I would have preferred them not tap out for a blocker. It's only one blocker. They attack. Maybe we get him. Maybe we get him. Don't have another thing. No more things. I can't beat more things. Oh, more things. Alright, we're gonna have to think here. We're gonna have to think that I'm dead. Pretty short. So if I breach bolt one. Yeah, this is doomed. Play the second Swift Spear. Play the breach. Attack with both. I'm dead. Uh, I guess I have to breach for Kenra as a blocker. Is that right? Breach Kenra. S. Block the Fury mutagenic growth. Such a terrible line. <laughs> But it's the line I have to do. If I breach attack, I guess I could do that. Attack with the Swiss Spear, then play the Kenra. There's no chance they don't block, right? No chance you don't block. Yeah, I didn't think so. I'm dead to a targeted removal spell. Ready to play some four color? Hell yeah. Best of luck. Okay. That's just unbeatable. Keep this reasonable. But it might be AFK. Nope, they Mulligan. What's up, Slayer? Why you Sedge? The Predge? No, the Predge. I think I'm spending at least one of these right now. I'll save the other one. For a rainy day. Sometimes you get the sads, you know? Why are you down? This is a... A safe space. I'm gonna get my therapist coat on. I'm gonna spend the other bubble. I kind of want that, but I'm going to bin it. I don't need no EI. I do need to attack him for three, though. The more cards I bin, the better this breach gets also. They're playing scam as well. Evidently, I'm in the scam bracket today. Why is there so much scam? Dingo. Spike. I uploaded my YouTube video, I don't remember. Yeah, I did. I did, I did. Oh, this is a Bob. You personally play hella scam because it bullies all the decks that you absolutely despise. I wish it bullied creativity a little bit better. But yeah, I feel you on that. It bullies Yogboth, which is like, good enough. Why aren't we playing Dingo Bingo? We already played Dingo Bingo. We played Dingo Bingo for the sub goal. I gave away two loot crates from the Dingo Bingo winners. Yeah, living in Titan and Tron, true. Format needs more Gaddick Teague. Creativity goes sweet Gaddick Teague. Lightning Bolt. I lose. It's, uh, these scam players gotta get a grip, man. Let the damage resolve first, and then, and then, you can rebirth it. This was like the clip of that scam player that attacked with Raghavan at the NRG and then got a Fury and they Furied using their opponent's Fury and they undined it and the opponent was like, thanks for the Fury. And they were like, huh, what? And they got Furied. Scam players, man, they gotta do better. That actually happened. I can, I'll pull up the clip. <laughs> Doomwake. Thank you for the raid. I'll be at a fantastic stream. And I'm dying to skim. Uh, I probably have to just buy Gigantha here. Thank you, Doomwake.
Did you get anything good in your Throne of Eldraine box? I saw that you were about to open it. Let me pull up the clip. So, here's the clip. So, they attacked with Raghavan, right? They revealed a fury, and they went pitch fury, undying it, and then the four color player was like, alright, my fury, fury Raghavan. And the scam player was just like, uh, uh, yeah, alright. <laughs> Goodbye, Raghavan. Yeah, plus one, plus one counter on it, and attacked him for lethal. Over two turns. Just one past the turn. Blood Moon pass, and then attack. Game. It was so sad. So sad. Don't ever make that mistake. Don't do it, Chad. It's not worth it. So they attacked me with a dashing ragster. Did I, uh, did I just do that? He was 5-0, and oh too. <laughs> they clipped and jumped. Is it Yoshi? Um, it is Yoshi, yeah. I'm so dead. Alright. Made top 8. It's actually pretty impressive to rally back from a loss like that. That one must have hurt the mental. I'm dead. Beastman, thank you for the tier 1. Welcome back for the 4 months. I think I was dead no matter what. I was trying to wait an additional turn so that I can get like a different creature out. But I didn't get another turn. I think we were in such a losing position at that point. It didn't really matter what we did. I brought in the soul guides last time. But I wasn't really a fan of the soul guides. But I might just need them. For mutagenic and a bobble. I like this. I understand the guy made a mistake, but his opponent was kind of a dick for how they explained it. I don't know. I didn't see the rest of the clip. Them's the rules. I didn't seem like the opponent did anything out of pocket from that clip. It just seemed like the scam player didn't realize how it worked. And it's not like there were any rules, violations, or anything. So, it's a totally legal play to undying the opponent's fury. That's why I always, like, strongly recommend to practice on Magic Online before going to a paper tournament, because once you get reps in on Magic Online, you won't make mistakes like that in paper. It's always good to, like, practice on an, a rules, automated rule system, even, like, X-Mage, for example. Just something that automates the rules so you know you're not making any mistakes. Obviously, we couldn't hear what the opponent said at the table, but this hand really sucks, huh? Missing triggers and paper is a little bit different from just like not knowing an interaction. Oh, back to mutagenic growth. Again, I didn't see the full clip, nor did I see the cockiness of the opponent. But speaking on strictly the play, that's just a good example of why you should always play on an automated rule system to practice for tournaments. I'm gonna give you the link to the bop. There's the bop. I drew my second land. Yay. I prefer paper though. You just angle shoot folks. Heck the automated rules. <laughs> okay, I mean, yeah, that's a response. Now, actually, I don't like playing on automated rule system because I prefer to angle shoot my opponent. Three wins, Dingo. Get with the times. <laughs> yeah, I know you're joking. That's still like, <laughs> still bad. <laughs> Out of pocket. Yeah, I'm getting scammed. Sounds about right. Ah, please. Let the grief resolve. And then undying malice. Yeah, people do angle shoot all the time and thinking it's fun. It's always good to form habits like that though, right? Even if it doesn't matter in this particular scenario when they cast the undying effect. You should always get yourself into a good habit of learning when you should cast it. It was a great draw, by the way. Don't need these upkeep stops. Ugh. My expressive iteration.
I buy Jagan, there's a good chance they grief it out of my hand, but I think that's okay. I think somebody even made an example on that Twitter thread where they were like, oh, they should have had a judge call over to have it rolled back the play because it was obviously intentional that the scam player was not trying to f get himself furied when in reality that's like not the case because not all the plays that were made were legal right and they gave an example they're like so if you ultimate a Liliana and the opponent has a ley line of sanctity it'll target yourself and obviously you don't want to do that so you can get it rolled back by the judge it's like yeah but you're trying to target an illegal target there whereas when you Undying the opponent's fury is a totally legal target. So it's not really something that you can roll back super easily. Welp, we're in trouble. Hopefully I don't hit anything good off the top of my deck. With the... And like other types of mistakes, the player controlling the trigger is 100% responsible for it. If you see your opponent make any other type of mistake during a match, you are obligated to call it... Attention to it, ignoring it for the for your advantage cheating. Triggered abilities are the exception. If your opponent misses one, it's legal for you to say nothing and profit from the mistake. It's not legal to intentionally ignore your own triggered abilities. Yes, indeed. Indeed, that is how it works. As to a certain degree, it's up to both players to maintain a legal board state. Skarmage. Fighting two blockers here. I'm dead to most things at this point. Even if you like Paper Magic better, I always strongly, strongly recommend practicing on MTGO. It'll make you a more technical player and you won't make paper-only plays as Mangu likes to call them. No one ever misses my baguette. Who did it better? No, I messed it up. I'm dyslexic. I'm going to one. Is it good enough? Common misconception. I actually did not invent Scam. Scam was around for a long time before I played it. I simply popularized Scam. I definitely didn't invent Scam. I'm not going to pretend like I did. Rob, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. I already lost the Scam last round. We thank you for the follow as well. I appreciate that. This is invented by Charles Ponzi. I'm gonna keep this. You always draw step on tap. You gotta be careful with that too. That's not what this anonymous quote says. I invented this deck and its name is Scam. I, Young Dingo, am a genius. Signed by Young Dingo's evil twin brother, Dadpool. Sub Diddy Pool? How you doing? Quote, boat, kill. <laughs> that's a good quote. I like that's something I've definitely said. Just checking in on your buddy. Magada's not here. Who are you checking in on? I don't see Magada. Do you see Magada? <laughs> I'm not your buddy, pal. Oh, I should have attacked. Whoops. I was like, I'll block in mutagenic. And just, that's a grief thing, though. I guess I'm blocking dashing Ragavan. Copium. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's fine because I could block Dashing Ragavan. If that were the case. Not a terrible misplay. Only a minor one. Ooh, now I can double block. I'm not your buddy, pal. No. Not supposed to fatal push. Well, shit. Uh, how doomed. Bad was the Grixis deck. We ended up 3-1 in the prelim and 2-3 in a league. The mana base was awful. Atrocious. If the mana wasn't so bad, it would probably have been okay. I'm so dead to another scam card. Oh. 
Alright, it looks like we're gonna be X and scam. See, the opponent did it right that time. They waited. Instead of holding priority and then casting it. Now I just lost another card from my hand. Land Unholy would do it. Office Iteration. And that's a concession for me. Wow. Alright, I'll keep this. It's not amazing. Goblin Gun. Swifty. Yeah, the Power of Grazer was not enough. Power of Grazer did not compel my opponent. Been a quick prelim so far. Well, I've been streaming for almost two hours already. I'm actually gonna block. I don't think they'll see the mutagenic growth coming. Let's get the ether creature. We're not in good shape. We're not in good shape at all. Sunbaked Canyon. I think I should maybe be able to kill my opponent next turn. I'll save the lightning bolt in case I need to bolt something. I was okay, but I really wasn't okay. I was not going to win that game. I was pretty much just fighting to not lose. I used to play Legacy, but I don't play Legacy anymore. I greatly dislike what they do with Legacy, adding in infinite amounts of commander cards. was not really enthused to play the format after that. I pretty much lost interest in Legacy right when Initiative got added to the format, and now you're like, Dingo, they banned the Initiative card. And it's like, yeah, but there's still Initiative cards in the format. The initiative deck is still pretty good. Hopefully putting him to one is good enough. He took first in the challenge with this. Archon, Gristlebrand, a reanimator. Seasoned Dungeoneer. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> Even reanimators play initiative cards. Four passageway seer four seasoned dungeoneer in the sideboard. Congratulations on winning the challenge, by the way. Very impressive, but goddamn. <laughs> That's the Legacy stuff I hate. Ugh. Buster Storm, Spell Pierce. Disgust me. Never run into initiative at all. Honestly, I think I might go back to playing Legacy at least a little bit once Comet the Stellar Pup gets released because I want to play Just Guy Control with Comet. I think I. Probably have to mulligan this hand. I don't know. Maybe I keep it. And I don't like Minskin Boo either. Minskin Boo is not fun. I want to like Legacy, but man, Legacy does not want me to like Legacy. Also, I really wish Legacy was more accessible in paper, but that's a whole other conversation in its own right. Now, it doesn't have the Triumph of St. Catherine or whatever it's called. I guess I'll keep this hand. I'm not going to be happy about it. I'm going to be real sad. <laughs> yeah, Jace nets you a couple cards every turn. And Minsk and Boo's just like, alright, smack you for 12, draw 4. It's like, why, why, why do you make a hamster every turn? Why don't I make a hamster every turn? Checkmate. A lot of European legacy tournaments will allow players up to 30 proxies. That's good, I'm glad to see that. Because I don't want legacy to die. I don't think it deserves that. But I think Wazi's honestly trying their best to, like, suppress Legacy. They don't want it to be around. They don't want it to be a competitive format. Because I feel like, deep down, at the core of Wazi, they know they messed up.
your LGS last 10 proxies. Yeah, I mean, as long as you can get whatever's on the reserve list, um, that's great. Having to buy reserve list cards is like such not a good financial decision. It makes the format incredibly inaccessible. Which is unfortunate. It really is. Nobody near you plays Legacy? Yeah. Could, well, part of the reason that nobody near you plays Legacy is because of how inaccessible it is, right? <laughs> I think if it were significantly cheaper, a lot more people would play it. Even, like, Modern's expensive. Searing Blood, huh? I'm not gonna EI because I have to fetch Shock if I hit a Steam Vents. I don't want to take that much damage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Another DRC. I think this Fluster Storm is going to get much better. Maybe I should have taken the Spell Pierce on top. Kind of crazy that they boarded in Deflecting Palm. Well, Modern's more affordable than Legacy, but I agree, it's not super affordable. Hold up, let's think about this. If we take the bull, that's no, not good enough. I'm just attacking the two DRCs. Yeah, modern's a lot easier to get into. I'm gonna hold this back for a haste blocker. Or haste attacker, rather. At the exile. A classic. Pink. Onk. Song the banger. Bum, 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 bum. Mango said Pioneer eats your soul. Mango does not like Pioneer. The problem with Pioneer is that, like, sometimes, and this happens more in Pioneer than in a format like Modern or Legacy, your choices do not matter. Even that it's a pile of furies against Yogg. What we got there? Omelette. Turn one, crack an egg, play an omelette. Hmm. Annoying. And Pile of Fury was me in high school. Nothing's changed since then. Nah, I'm just kidding. Hi, Gonti. Can you tell these people to stop downplaying Murktide? I can't stand for this Murktide downplay any longer. You must show the people the light. And now I have access to Empty Geo. Non cohesive. Thank you for the tier one. Welcome back for the six months. Appreciate you. Can't handle the downplay. 45% win rate, by the way. And who would get boiled? Certainly not me. I'm alpha striking. Good luck, opponent. Dude, Spike, like, made me never want to play control again. Because he boiled me so much. Hmm, Kenra, not great.
I don't think I survived this next turn. Hmm, especially not with surveils like that. Yeah, it's a cosmic rebirth for me to return. Still thinking about the audacity of that YouTube comment being like, how can you call this deck cosmic control and not even know that cosmic rebirth doesn't return permanent or doesn't return non-permanence? I'm like, dog, I read the card for the first time when I was playing the deck. <laughs> Calm down. Mr. Streamer Bad doesn't know what the new card does. I'm gonna roast them. <laughs> Chad YouTube chat. Yeah, I'm like sad Doge Dingo versus Chad YouTube chat. It took everything in me not to respond to that comment. Like, don't do it, Dingo. It's not worth the trouble. <laughs> YouTube comments are ruthless. Just, they just say whatever's on their mind. It wasn't even a misplay. It was just me being like, oh, I can't target this because it's a, not a permanent. That's right. They were like, you're... How can you name this deck after a card? You don't even know how it works. Or the YouTube comment that just straight up gaslit me. And they tried to tell me that the new Obnix list from Aftermath came out a year ago. I was like, how are you going to gaslight me? <laughs> you're straight up lied to my face. Maybe it was just the time traveler. They came back from the future just to tell me that that card's a year old now. Like future trunks from Dragon Ball. I'm dead, right? Do we have another land to double strike it? Nah, I guess we'll find out. Do we have another Boros Garrison? Because they bounced it back to their hand, which seemed like a mistake to me. Because they're supposed to get Vesuva and copy it. it leaves, refuses to elaborate. Oh yeah, I saw that. Sometimes the audio desyncs, but most of the time it's fun. I think. <laughs> Zeriok, thank you for the 100 bits, but I'd prefer not to start a pitchfork riot against the one hater in the comments. But you can if you want. I'm not going to stop you. But I'm not going to promote it either. That's the guy I aspire to be. I'm going to think about that comment for the rest of the time now. Not going to be able to sleep. Yeah, it's the algorithm boost. Alright, looks like we're not dead somehow. That was you? Unbelievable. You drew an EI, also kind of unbelievable. Uh-oh. Hmm. If I turn on Delirium, is that good enough? If I mill a Lava Dart? I think I have to mill a Lava Dart here. I didn't turn on Lava Dart, but I did turn on Delirium. I did. I should have cracked this, probably. He died. Wouldn't get there. Not a very strong EI. Need that EI to find me a spell. Edge, Sedge. I found me a Lava Dart that was lethal. Uh, I think Bolt was also lethal, and Holy Heat was probably lethal. Made quite a few good hits there. Mutagenic Growth can come out in this matchup, it's not very strong. I can probably trim one of the Breaches as well. Why is it looking like Vapor Snag in this matchup? Uh, Vapor Snake seems kind of sketchy. We just run it like this. I had a Blood Moon in it, so I'm going to keep it. It's not a very good hand, though. My opponent's mulliganing to four. Oh, no. <laughs> Thank you for all your bits, Ariok. Is it Prowess, and you don't even know that the Is it Guild was the fifth guild in Ravnica? Unbelievable. I want another Metamorphose. Not really. But it's kind of free, so I'm going to keep it. <laughs> it is kind of free. We do need to find a threat, though. Well, bro's going to watch this on YouTube in a few days. Good. I hope so.
this is my way of coping with suspicious YouTube comments. I'm going to call them suspicious instead of what I actually want to call them. Kind of see himself get absolutely toasted. I don't think I'm gonna cycle any metamorphosis here. Moon, no. go. Yeah, like a, a positive good Samaritan who told me my audio was desynced. I think I probably keep one of these metamorphoses in my hand in case I draw an iteration or something. Oh. All right. That's cool. I'll iterate. More iteration? Don't mind if I do. I've got to get more iteration. Triple prowess trigger. Blue. Red. Yai. Bottom exile. Bobble trigger. Hmm. I think I'm dead. Probably. I'm just gonna drop a bunch of cards. They could have an endurance here. I do have an endurance. I'm across for 15. Lava. I should seal the deal, right? Why do they play so many mountains? Because they're part werewolf and they looked at the moon. Such a sketchy hand. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it mostly because of the shattering spree. Am I casting shattering spree on one? Can I wait? I think I can wait a turn. Famous last words. They're about to wombo off on me. Mycosynth Garden. It's actually the punishment for not shattering spring. But if I put a sticker on my guacamole goblin, is it day or night? Endurance? I'm trying to comprehend that. I mean, that's fine. No replicate. Just use that to destroy that. I think I can bend the heat. Play Soul Scar Mage and pass. Hopefully, I draw land. That way, I can go like Swift Spear, land, Manamorphos, Lava Dart, Lightning Bolt. Yeah, I can't handle the power of Guacamole Goblin, precisely. Just couldn't comprehend what you just said to me. I need me a land. Want to buy land. Yay. Land, Swifty, Bolt. In a blood moon? How close to dead are they if I bin this blood moon? I'm gonna bin it. If it's wrong to bin the blood moon, I don't wanna be right. Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'll keep that on top. Can't quite deal enough damage this turn. But I also don't think I need the blood moon to win. I can't believe you got me with that one, Zeriok. Unreal. Didn't that turn it on? It's not great. You already got me with that one yesterday. I'm gonna remember that forever.
Let you to one, two, go. You need new material. Unique dripping. Limitless swag. Against all odds, he secures the bag. Maybe. They don't pop off on me here. If they have Bounce Land Titan, I'm dead, right? Because they have Land Drop for turn. I can't believe I'm going to lose this game. This is so sad. I should have topped the Blood Moon. You can believe it. Ah, ah, ah. Titan player does not draw Titan. Alright, we're 2 2 Yeah, pick the title. Modern. With Have you peaked? Bing bong, bing bong, bing bing bong. Have you peaked? You're a third rate duelist. I can't take it anymore. <laughs>